Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the Softcore Brony. Uh, getting interrupted just before I was going to announce that this is my 100th video uh, upload on Let's Play My Little Pony RPG, The Elements of Harmony. Uh, not really anything special planned, unfortunately. I just, it actually kind of snuck up on me there. <laughs> but, uh, anyway, since last time I, uh, actually ran out of oats. <laughs> Uh, and had to leave and to get s but fortunately I made up for it a little bit by fighting green ogres twice in a row just now which is nice now this room is basically empty except for what's so except for up here in this corner I've checked the whole room this is the only place to go uh, anyway as I was saying uh, about me uh, having to leave last time uh, herb, uh, well, 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 what yeah. is with the encounter rate all of a sudden jeez Anyway, fortunately, Ponyville was, is almost directly south of this location, so uh, I had an easy time, uh, you know, getting more oats and all that. Now, this room is relatively simply laid out, but it's interesting because we have crystals in it that'll teleport us to different parts of the room. Now, fortunately, I already took the time to uh, map, out, map all this out, so I'm just going to ignore this crystal right here altogether and come to these two here. First thing I want to do is go into do to this crystal, which just leads me there and back again to uh, a treasure chest. Right down here, right directly below where we just were. Yeah, 2,000 bits, all right. Yeah, directly above me is those two crystals that I just said, and if you keep walking down and around over there, uh, you'll eventually come to another crystal that uh, will lead you to the exact same place. Oh. That will... Okay, let me get back to it. But yeah, if you keep on going down and around this path, uh, it'll lead you to the exact... to a crystal that will lead you to the exact same place as this crystal right here. So don't bother going around that way. Ahem! I'm not going to take that crystal. Sorry. <laughs> I, uh, was looking at, uh, the wrong thing on my map there. Or rather, I was looking at the wrong letter on my map. I do want to go into this crystal first. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> That's right, I actually want to get the treasures this time through. Anyway, this will lead us over here to this treasure chest. 2,500 bits, alright, and then next I want to take this crystal down here. Which will lead me to only one choice, which is this crystal down here. And I think every... whenever you uh, teleport it kind of resets the random encounter rate, because the encounter rate in here seems kind of low. Which, as I just said, I think it's because of all the teleporting. Anyway, next, I oh, I want to get the treasure first. Heal, that'll be useful. Uh, I want to go into this crystal now. Let's see, and this will take me over there. So I want to go up into this crystal now. Which will take me right down there to those four treasure chests that are down there. Or the room below it, actually. Because this is where I want to go. Thousand bits, and aid, green, and oats. All right. Hmm, well, I haven't needed oats yet. Maybe I didn't need to go all the way back. Oh, well. Nice little straight shot with some nice free treasures. Red. 250 bits. Ah. How am I doing on bits? Ooh, 100... Ooh, right, I'm... Just about gonna make my goal. Ha ha ha! Yeah! Let's see. In this, aid, green, more oats. Alright. Can never have enough of those. Let's see. A couple more treasures. Nice. 803 bits. Cake. Red. Red. Green. All right. Let's see, do I need to? Yeah, let's just use those reds, shall we? Let's 
Oh, there he is! Oh, finally! I was beginning to think I wasn't gonna run into this guy. All right, Chimera, or is it Chimera? I think it's pronounced Chimera. I mean, that's how they pronounce it on. Uh, uh, what was it called? Uh, Full Metal Alchemist, right? Now, Chimera, I don't think he's really affected by a whole lot there. He doesn't seem to have any elemental weaknesses. He's not affected by a whole lot of status effects, if any. So we're just, yeah, go all out against him. Um. Let's get a heal going just in case. He can use cold breath, among other things. Let's see what else he does. He actually has a uh, pretty strong natural physical attack. He also uses Rasp, which drains MP. Although, now that I think about it, I should note uh, Pinkie Pie is immune to any Rasp abilities. So, uh, if they ever do that, hopefully it hits her. Yeah, he's done for. Not much of a threat, despite his high HP. Well, he does do that. Ow! I guess that's his most dangerous move. I didn't realize he did that. It's the first time I've seen him do that. In all the few times that I've fought him. Alright, AJ! If only there was a way to increase her critical hit rate. I mean, she can, like, one-shot anything. Let's see now. I definitely want to heal after that. Jeez. Does anybody else need... Nope. We're good, we're good, we're good. Might need some oats there, though. No, you're good. Alright. And in this treasure chest? <sighs> okay. Now I know why this episode's spe so special. Because I have to re-record three-fourths of it. <laughs> oh. Yeah, part of it, unfortunately, didn't record due to an accidental button push on my part. And, uh, oh, due to an oversight, another part actually has no sound, so I'm just going to do the whole rest of it, starting from, uh, right here. Since there was something I wanted to do anyway that I didn't. Uh, for this, I want to have lightning protection for every pony, although you might want to have, uh, confusion protection accessories and every, uh, for everyone. Although, Twilight still has speed for a particular reason here. While we open this treasure chest, which has... nothing. Really? Well, what did we come here for, then? Wait, what? Whoa! Alright, boss fight against the Guardian, which looks pretty darn cool. I'm not really sure if this is like a default monster, or something that's just from the... Or from, uh, I don't know what, but, uh, first thing I want to do is slow two, because this thing is really fast. It can actually flip-flop with, uh, Rainbow Dash. So, uh, otherwise, let's see, it's attack, attack. Now, this guy is susceptible to stun, so I do want to kick it every chance I get. As always, scroll on Rarity and Mine 2. I really hope this guy does not open up with, uh, Oh, that's one of the things... Oh, wow, that was kind of fortunate. Well, either that or Deadly Poison. All right. Got that on right away. Uh-oh. That's not good. Okay. All right, AJ. All right. Try again. Uh, just in case, kick. Get a squirrel on you, and I want to try to fear him now to get his defense down. Wow, he is fast. Sheesh. Oh, dang. All right, stunned him. Good, good. Always good. He can do a variety of things. Deadly poison and sickle weasel can do massive damage. Lightning, too, he can do some, do some pretty darn good damage, too, which is why I have lightning protection. Let's see, now that I... Did I slow him down? Oh, it still didn't work. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, this is going a little bit more poorly than I was expecting. Actually, I don't need to do that this turn. So... Hmm. Well, not much else I can do. Unfortunately, he's not affected by any other status effects, so... Attack. And I didn't get fear on him either, huh? Alrighty. Oh, actually, I should have tried to stun him. Ah, oh, yeah. I forgot I didn't have slow two on him somehow. Wow! What's with all the missing there? Whoa! 
Does he, like, have some kind of inherent, like... I don't know. <laughs> wow, usually I can get slow two on him in the first turn. I'm a little surprised. Okay, stare at him. I'm getting a little concerned here. Unfortunately, that's not gonna work this turn, is it? All oh, right, got them both on him. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Ow. Oh, actually, that wasn't that bad. I was expecting that to do more damage than that. Huh. I wonder if that counts as, like, lightning damage or something. Maybe it's not wind. That's odd. Well, anyway, now I can finally start tempering some ponies. All right, as usual, AJ, you're first. Let's see, you're slowed down now. So, this time, I don't need to do that. Um... As long as I have a red. Oh, actually, every pony kind of needs a little bit. Never mind. Just attack there. Just, uh, yeah. Get some regular healing going. Should be good enough for now. Alright. Doing well. Temperance. Kick. Stare. I don't really need any healing. Uh, get a fog on yourself, just in case of whatever. Because he can use Temperance himself to power himself up, so... Although he doesn't really do a heck of a lot of physical attacks. Stare him! Oh. Dang it, that just never seems to work, does it? Oh well. Regular physical confusion. Hey, and you fogged yourself! Alright, that worked out nicely. And Timber's on. Pinkie Pie. Kick. Stare. Alright, here too. Ooh, we're running out of magic power there. Hmm, I'll probably have to reestablish agility as well. He's probably gonna run out of... Actually, when did I get speed down on him? He might run out, run out of it relatively soon, but... Alright, gotta reestablish some buffs here. Aw, AJ! Alright. Lightning 3 is really the best we can do. He's not weak against any particular elements, although Nuke will work even better if you happen to have that. So... Alright, still got defense down and agility. Kick him, stare him. Get mine 2 to give us some bu uh, buffer and also boost uh, Twilight there. Oh, and I need to speed up uh, Rarity, too. For whenever he uh, gets out of slow. Alright, not doing too bad on the MP there. Oh, almost got him, too. Alright. And he doesn't. Alright. Alright. Well, I got an oat, but he's almost dead, so... Did I use kick? I don't recall. Alright, we're doing fine right now. Just have her attack. Alright! That's working out very well. This guy can also use rasp uh, on individual party members, which uh, lowers their MP, but... Uh, one thing to know, Pinkie Pie is immune to the rasp spell. So... All right, I practically have this guy. Yeah. Ooh. Wait, did he use Rasp already? How are you so low on MP, Fluttershy? I thought I restored it. Huh. Well, we're doing pretty good there. Ooh, he's got his speed back. That's bad. That's bad. Ow. I wasn't paying attention to his speed. Uh-oh. Oh, bad time for that. He's almost dead, but I gotta slow him down. Well, yeah, I'm gonna slow him down. Oh, Rainbow Dash. Okay, let's not use Phoenix. Okay. 
And I want to get, since you're still... You have agility on yourself, right? Yeah, so you should be faster than Rainbow Dash. This is gonna hurt! Oh! But you're not, and you got killed! Oh, come on! That sucks. Rainbow Dash? What the heck? You're supposed to be the loyal one! Oh, this is bad. Well, not too bad, but... Hmm... Actually, I need you. I need that cake. Attack. I gotta unconfuse Rainbow Dash. Well, she unconfused herself. Okay, then. Too bad you didn't use that on AJ, but... Well, this is going terribly now. He got the drop on me because of that speed of his. Oh, that's not bad. All right. Yeah. Let's... Get some cake flying around there. Well, this certainly got interesting. I didn't consider this boss to be all that hard, but I uh, didn't pay close enough attention to his speed. <laughs> Ooh, and then of course there's that. Is Rainbow Dash confused again? Come on! Jeez! Wow, this guy's really... Uh... Rainbow Dash, are you going to kill me again? You're gonna try. Sheesh. Well. Oh, AJ. Good thing I slowed him down. That was pointless. Is he back up to speed again? Not yet. He doesn't have much left. If we do, we do. If we don't, oh well. Oh well. Oh, we did! Didn't matter. I shouldn't have wasted it. We're just gonna get healed after this battle anyway. Oh well. I had the spare cake. He's done for. Almost got me there. <laughs> really took me by surprise with that darn confusion. Yeah, it would be good to have confusion protection in this fight, but it is a little expensive to get. Anyway, for this, we get heal, and we also get a gem to complement the ruby we already had, which I think would have been sufficient, but... Yeah, how'd you... Oh. Well. Anyway. Uh, we're totally healed now, so I'm gonna make... I'm going to... Well, I'm gonna meet you at the bottom of the, uh, stairs there, so I can show you how to get back out through that, uh, maze. <laughs> Alright, now, getting out of here takes a little bit of, uh... Well, know-how as well. Now, one thing to note is that that crystal that I ignored earlier, the one just a little over there to the right, if you took it, it would take you right here to where this crystal takes us. Yeah, right to this spot here, so it's actually a little faster to get here. Uh, because once you do, you can just take this one. And then just take the one up there, and you'll get back down, th down to uh, the stairs there again. But, uh, I decided to do it the other way just so I could get the treasures uh, on the way up, which we're going to get on the way back, or be passing by on the way back anyway. So if you don't mind getting the treasures after, or on the way back, then you can do it this way instead. Let's see, takes you back over here to this treasure chest. And... Let's see, I want to go to down to this one. Which will take me up there again. Let's 
simply down to this crystal. Uh, this crystal, once I get out of that battle there. And now, which takes us to that one, instead of going over there, we're just going to take this crystal, which will take us right out, over to that, uh, long table over there, which is... kind of odd. I don't know what this table is doing here exactly, but, uh, anyway, I'm going to meet you outside. Actually, you know what? I'm going to meet you, uh, next to, uh, Ponyville, because I'm going to be sleeping after I get out of here. And then we'll, uh, continue on. Alrighty then, all healed, right, set and ready to go. So, let's get back to those Parasprites. Which is fairly easy to do from here as we just uh, go this a ways. Straight south to Canterlot, and then straight down here is where the Parasprites live. Alrighty. Now that we've got their, uh, freaking gem, I suppose I could have started just right here, but anyway, yeah, now that we have their freaking gem, unknown purpose. Alrighty. Okay, dude, here's your gem. What are you gonna do with it anyway? What, they're not going to tell us? Teleportation powers? Something important, huh? Okay, we gotta teleport. Get out of the way. Don't go! Thank you. Don't want to get stuck in that again. Anyway, teleporter, huh? Oh, it's actually a usable item. Warps the boat. Boats? Really? Well... Not really. You just had to relocate the boat, that's all. Manhattan or someplace called Trottingham, which we've never been to before. Huh. That's interesting. Well, anyway, before that, there's a few things that uh, we need to do. Let me think. So long as... Yeah, I know where we're going to go. So long as we're here... Straight south, once again, and now, okay, and we hit land, so over here should be where I'm looking for, which is the desert. Land straight in it, you remember this place. Now, I'm going to have slightly different money than what I would have and also will have in the next video, because I'm going to continue from my, uh, uh, my non-re-recording. Uh, after this. So, anyway, I want to buy the dust now. Just one. You can buy more than one if you want, but it's a total waste of money. It's not going to get you anything more. So, just buy one dust for 18,000 bits. Don't walk back inside by accident. Let's see, now that we're here... Let's go straight south, over this way, and I'll hit New Cloudsdale right over here. Did I miss it? Nope. There he is. Alrighty. Now, since I actually do have a lot of money, I think... How much do I have right now? Yeah, I have like 141,000 bits <laughs> in my other game, which I'm going to be keeping. But, uh, anyway, I want to go here. Because, well, there's actually some things I forgot to uh, explain anyway, now that I think about it. But, uh... I'm going to hold off on the weapons here. There's actually good reason to do so, since these are still very expensive. Though I do want to buy the, uh, not that, ultimate armor. Three of those for my remaining characters there. And uh, otherwise, let's see, I think there's a, let's see, there's a couple new things in here. Being life, which casts auto-regen on a pony if it's equipped. It recovers 10% of your HP every turn. Uh, which I guess could be useful. And the other new thing is Exfer, which prevents you from getting any stat downs, although it won't protect you uh, the any stats you have stat up on already. Uh, 
probably not as useful that that useful really. So I don't really care about either of those myself personally. But uh, anyway, let's see. Like Twilight has like what 58 right now. So oh wow, she actually has a little bit more than Pinky, but not anymore. All right, looking good for these ponies. Especially Rainbow Dash. <laughs> Alrighty. So anyway, while we're here, I'm not gonna go to the magic shop. Not this one, anyway. Not the one up there, either. What I wanna do... Is go up here to this, because now that we have that, uh... Magic Dust, we can use it here. And he mix a potion with it. Which we will be needing, uh, soon. An oxygen potion! Which allows us to breathe under water? Huh. Well, what the heck are we gonna do with that? Well, find out next time on Let's Play My Little Pony RPG, The Elements of Harmony. Arrivederci!